What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable source on the internet right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K22 My Team video. And guys, today, <clears throat> we are going over the market. We got a couple new things on um, in the market today as well. We're going to go over that. Uh, before we get into the video, if you guys could please smash that sub button, like the button, comment down below. Let's get some comments. Let's get some comments. Let's get some comments. Let's get some likes. All that good stuff. We're going to go over to market. Um, tomorrow, we're going to have some new content, so get ready for that. We're going to have some very, very nice content. Um, but yeah, let's go over. Let's pop these little pre-order packs that are literally duty. Um, but yeah, we're going to go over some stuff. Uh, I think we got some like triple threat players or something like that. Um, so we're gonna go over that. Let's see what 2k did release. They also dropped the moments of Edwards and Jelly Oubre um, So earn Leandro Barbosa when you complete season 2 limited war world week up four challenge We want a sapphire Leandro Barbosa that makes absolutely no sense to me. Um, but yo, they also uh, Released a a little um, Kelly Oubre and Anthony Edwards, so that's actually pretty cool um, Also, if you guys do need MT make sure to be up. I'm buying and selling MT on both consoles, but here we go a little pink diamond edwards a little jubre a little uh tyrese maxi i love that guy he uh he's really really good but yo edwards dude anthony edwards is a beast let's pop this pack we're actually gonna pull him in this pack as you guys can see boom oh my god imagine oh my god all right we're just gonna pop one of these packs i just thought is this maxi i'll take him oh it's not maxi uh who's the power forward Sixers power forward. Maxi ain't no power forward. George McGinnis? Hey, yo, I'll take that. I think he's pretty rare, actually. That was a little weird. I'll take that George McGinnis, though. I ain't not gonna complain. All right, yo. Let's get into this. So, <clears throat> let's go over to filter. Um, Tomorrow, there's gonna be a market crash. They have to release some fire tomorrow. They haven't released fire in a couple weeks, in my opinion. I think the, I think the content in the last couple weeks has been really trash. So honestly, I say we get some crazy content tomorrow, expecting a huge market crash. To be completely honest with you, that's exactly what's gonna happen. I really do expect a really giant market crash. It only makes sense, in my opinion. I really do believe we should get a big market crash. Um, yo, um, let's go over this market. As you guys can see right now, the market's already starting to crash. Like it's starting to go down, 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 down. Yesterday, as you guys know, I did buy that Lucius Allen for a little snipe, sold him for a little thousand out, a thousand extra, but now. He's actually the cheapest player up here. And he actually has really, really, really good stats. Um, I don't know why he's so cheap. He has amazing stats. Three-point shot, defense, all that. He's also fast. Um, do I think Lucius Allen is a good investment? Is he even in packs? He is in packs. I honestly think he's a good investment. I think he's a bunch of baller. Even though not a lot of people know who he is, he's not hype. I think he's still really good stats. And I think he still has a really good jump shot. So I believe that you should honestly invest in this guy. Um, I think you can get them for 2500 all day. Once again, guys, I'm on PS4, so if the Xbox market looks a little different, that's why. Definitely try out the Aminus filter anyways. I think Lucius Allen is a good investment, though. Try this Aminus filter out. It might be dry. It's probably a little bit better on Xbox, but yo, try it out. I'm going to buy this one for 28 I think that's just a little too cheap. Anyways, let's get into the diamond filter. Let's get into the diamond filter. Let's go. Um, Rashawn Holmes absolutely destroying this bad boy absolutely destroying this filter um literally absolutely destroying this filter so yo we're gonna go over what players you should buy all right yo so here we go dive filter is also tough now and it is honestly kind of annoying because 2k is really coming at our filters 2k is really coming at our filters like hardcore that's not good they're really really finding ways to help us not make mt to help us buy some bc and honestly that's just a fact um, I mean, like, Rashawn Holmes hasn't been relevant in the NBA for, like, his whole career, and they drop a diamond Rashawn Holmes. But they drop an Amethyst Maxi, who's a rookie, who's hype. It makes absolutely no sense to me. I'm kind of upset about that. <sighs> but looking at the Pink Time Filter, let's see what they got. Pink Time Filter is still up there in value. Ah, and look, another one. They released a Ricky Rubio Pink Diamond, dude. Ricky Rubio was always a decent player his whole career. They should have just dropped an Amethyst. They had to drop a pink diamond Rubio. I mean, yo, honestly, he did have some crazy stats. Not gonna lie, this card's actually really good, but like, it just destroys the market. They just literally do this to make the market go boom down. Um, preventing you guys to make some market moves, preventing you guys to make some MT. And honestly, I don't know, it's just, it's kind of annoying. It's, they're really good at marketing, I guess. 
for their own selves. There's just really no way to make MT if these filters are flooded with moments cards. Um, like again, you can get a really good snipe. You can make a lot of MT. It's just the chances are a little bit lower now. Um, anyway, let's go over a minimum. Let's go over a maximum. Um, yeah, minimum, maximum, 100K. Look at this. Moses Ka also ruining this at 100K. So Moses Ka also ruining this a little bit. Um, you do have to know pricing very, very well. Pink Diamond, Nick Batum. Oh, wow. He, you could Evo Nick Batum to a Pink Diamond. Wow, I didn't even know that. That makes sense. That makes sense why his diamond was actually going for a lot. Um, so pink diamonds is another filter, yo. It's like good for like buyouts. Like if any diamonds go to a buyout. Not only that, keep checking Kobe Bryant's price, guys, at a diamond. To be honest, um, he is the only diamond, but you can put your minimum buyout to 100,000 MT on the diamond end and see if Kobe pops up. If that is the case, that's a big come up right there. But then again, diamonds are kind of flooded out. But if a Kobe pops up for a buyout, you're gonna make some MT. Um, I didn't even know LeBron was a buyout. Jelly Oubre is pretty good too, but obviously for a buyout, you got to check his price. This Jelly Oubre card is pretty dang solid, especially for the price. Um, but yeah, Diamond, definitely check out for maybe even some LeBrons, depending on what I have on them. OG Anobi was really expensive. Let's check out his price. There's just a lot of pricing. There's a lot of pricing you should know. Look at this. There's like no OGs up here. This guy's insane. First off, he's an amazing shooter. He could dunk very well. And I mean, he's clamps. He's just amazing stats all around. Um, definitely keep your eyes on my boy OG. And then another one is LeBron. Keep your eyes on LeBron. And I'm going to give you another sleeper pick. Um, first off, LeBron, Miami Heat version is going to be up there. But yo, I'm going to give you a little sleeper pick. Keep checking on this card. This is a very rare card in the game. There's not a lot out there. Mr. Ray Allen. This card is really rare. There's not a lot up here as it is. And honestly, there was just not a lot of produced. If you get some for 15K, this car could be like 50K in the future. This car has a lot of chance to go up. He has very good stats, good defense, good three-point shot. This car just literally came out so far back. And he actually is, he is still compete, compatible stats. Keep your eyes on this Ray Allen. This is going to be one of the rarest cards when it comes down. When people need to complete that set and they're looking for Ray Allen, this could be the card. I'm just saying down the road, if you do have Ray Allen, if you go to Colossal right here, um, wherever this Ray Allen is, they're going to be rare. This whole entire set is very rare. Keep your eyes on this set. It's going to it's gonna be very interesting. Look at this Manu. I see one up for 100k. Even Manu, guys, this whole set is going to be really rare. You're never going to see these sets in packs ever again. But that's just what I think. Yo, we're going to pop this pack. Let's see what Edwards is going for. And let's check his stats. I don't even check his stats. Three-point shot, 88. Defense, defense is terrible. This this card is not worth it. Even though Edwards does usually have a really good jump shot, and it is Anthony Edwards, and a lot of people hat like him, his, his card's just not worth 100K. It's just not. You need good defense now. Um, in order to compete, you really need some good defense. But, yo, we're going to pull some fire right here. Uh, all right, yo. That's going to be it for the... You know what? We'll pop two more. You know what? Nah, we're going to save our money for tomorrow. But, yo, that's all we got for the vid. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.